Hey guys, welcome back to the Beautiful Tangled Mess channel. Now this video is going to be a little bit different today and yes, my thumbnail was clickbait and I have reasons for why I am doing the video the way I'm doing this video. Like I said, it's not gonna be a very entertaining video but there's some changes that are going to be made in regards to my YouTube channel. No, I am not deleting it. But I wanted to read something to you that has come across from YouTube. And I'm pretty sure you guys have already heard about this, but this is just my opinion and my, my perspective on this whole thing. Um, and because I have a fantastic community, whether it's huge or small, I love everybody in my community. It's a beautiful community. And I appreciate all the support that I've gotten over the years with my videos. And I'm glad that I was able I am able to be super entertaining <laughs> for you guys and I I'm still baffled sometimes that you think that I'm funny. Something is going on with the neighbor downstairs, I think, and it's creeping me out. I got an email from YouTube, okay? This is what it said. I'm going to read it in the entirety. Uh sorry if this is boring, but uh I I felt like I needed to express this anyway. Beautiful Tangled Mess. Today we are announcing changes to the YouTube Partner Program. While our goal remains to keep the YouTube Partner Program open to as many channels as possible, we recognize we need more safeguards in place to protect creator revenue across the YouTube ecosystem. And here's what is changing. Under the new eligibility requirements announced today, your YouTube channel, my YouTube channel, Beautiful Tangled Mess, is no longer eligible for monetization because it doesn't meet the new threshold of 4,000 hours of watch time within the past 12 months and 1,000 subscribers. As a result, your channel will lose access to all monetization tools and features associated with the YouTube Partner Program on February 20th, 2018. That was yesterday. Unless you surpass the threshold in the next 30 days, accordingly, this email serves as a 30 days notice that as 30 days notice that your YouTube partner program terms are terminated. One of YouTube's core values is to provide anyone the opportunity to earn money from a thriving channel. Creators who haven't yet reached this new threshold can continue to benefit from our Creator Academy, our Help Center, and all the resources on the Creator site to grow their channels. Once your channel reaches the new threshold, it will be reviewed to make sure it adheres to our policies and guidelines, and if so, monetization will be re-enabled. The YouTube team. 30 days to reach 4,000 hours of watch time? I'm sorry, I am a very small channel, and I don't do this for a living, and I feel like I would be stressing myself out so much just to try to reach 4,000 hours and 1,000 subscribers and putting in money to trying to promote everything when I still struggle with finances. Yes, I, I know I didn't make a lot of money with the monetization I made. I made $12 and that was pretty impressive in my opinion, but it's not the fact that I'm not getting monetized anymore that bothered me. It was the fact that I got this email. I don't know, I don't understand why it bothered me or affected me. It, I think it was just the fact that it said, your YouTube partner program is being terminated. And unless you can get to a thousand, I have 235 subscribers now. I lost a couple of subscribers, but I, I needed to get to 1000 subscribers in 30 days and get and reach 4,000 hours of watch time, which I think I have surpassed that. But how, I don't understand how I'd be able to get a thousand subscribers in 30 days unless I do some drastic things on my YouTube channel to reach that and get trending. For example, I'd have to eat one of these and do the Tide Pod challenge. Am I gonna do that? No! Uh, I'd have to be like Logan Paul and do something super, super controversial and be super, super disrespectful and somehow become the favorite of YouTube. And this is all just speculation and I know that I'm jumping on the bandwagon, but that's not me. I am not a controversial person. Therefore, I'm not gonna do anything crazy like Logan Paul or Jake Paul to get a million subscribers. I'm not gonna do stupid challenges that might kill me. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna be me. And regardless of whether or not I get paid to do things on YouTube, 
I still have a community that I love very much, so I am still going to be making videos. However, I'm not gonna care what the content is. If I accidentally swear in a video, oh well, I'm not getting monetized anyway, so who cares? And I'm, who cares if it's a 10 minute video? It may be a five second video. I don't care anymore. I'm gonna do me and I'm not gonna care about the offending anybody at YouTube or offending people. I'm gonna be me. And I have subscribers and a community and a family that appreciate the content that I make and I'm gonna still do it. And I'm not gonna care whether or not I get paid for it because that really wasn't the whole point. I barely got any money anyway. It just bothers me that I was part of the program and oh hey guess what we're changing stuff because there's inappropriate content on YouTube even though your content is pretty much innocent besides the little alcohol videos I, I get fired basically so no I am not gonna be eating this and no I am not gonna be doing crazy things I'm gonna be me and I'm gonna be funny and goofy and silly and not gonna try to bleep out accidental swear words and that was the point of this video as well because I'm gonna be up doing a lot of updates on my YouTube channel it just stung a little bit not not the money wise thing it was just huh I was part of YouTube oh hey Kristoff I was part of the YouTube I've been part of the YouTube family since 2006 or 2007 and yes my youtube channel has changed a lot and i've had several youtube channels that now i'm trying to get rid of but i can't remember my youtube or my um my email address and the password to those old ones so <laughs> i've been with these guys for a long time and it's funny because a lot of people tell me why aren't you popular like i don't understand why you're not you have more subscribers, you're funny, you're amazing. I don't know. <laughs> ask YouTube. Don't ask me. I don't know why either. Uh, maybe it's just because I'm not putting in enough effort. I'm not making it a full-time job to make myself well-known with the YouTube community. I have other jobs. I have other responsibilities. This is a hobby for me, but it's a hobby that I love because I love editing videos. So some of the updates. I'm only having one YouTube channel. I have a gaming channel that I'm going to merge with beautiful tangled mess i'm it's going to be a series instead of a channel it'll be a beautiful gaming mess and i'm going to be getting rid of all my other youtube channels and just focusing on what i like not what subscribers do i need to, or not what channels do i need to subscribe to in order to get popular i'm going to subscribe to channels that i like and it's just going to be 100 percent what I want to do. And yes, I am still taking requests. <laughs> uh, and I still would like to know what you want to see me do on this channel. But of course, I still value your guys' opinion. So if you want to give me suggest more suggestions on what you want me to do on my channel, fine, go ahead. Like, honestly, I love it because it gives me ideas on what you guys want to see. But no, I am not doing the Tide Pod Challenge. I'm not going to do any challenges that will cause me to throw up or that are supposed to kill me uh with that being said i will still do food challenges i'm still i still love doing challenges and i love singing so i might do some singing on this channel and who knows who knows it's just i feel a lot of weight and pressure is taken off now because of this so anyway i know this is a very random video but there are going to be some days where I'm just going to do 100% gaming videos for a while. There are going to be some days where I'm doing challenges. There are some days where I'm making stuff or food stuff or whatever. But it's all going to be on this one channel, Beautiful Tangled Mess. And I'm still not leaving. It's just going to be more condensed into one channel instead of trying to branch out to get more revenue. It's just going to be me. Hi, it's me, <laughs> Beautiful Tangled Mess. By the way, my hair is so curly. I got new hair products today and... My goodness, my curls are just amazing. Well, this is me. I love you guys, and thank you so much for all the support and for all the suggestions on what you want to see me do on this channel. I'm still looking at them. I'm still going to do burping challenges. I think that's not going to go away. By the way, I got demonetized for one of my burping challenges because it was inappropriate. And I argued with them like, uh, no, first of all, I didn't swear. Second of all, I was burping. But that's it. Like, I don't understand what the big deal was, though. So there are some weird things going on with YouTube. So anyway, I probably won't try to monetize anything in the future. I'm just going to do my channel the way I want to do my channel. 
And I love you guys, so I still want to keep doing this for you, and I love editing, and I love making you guys laugh, and I love making you smile if you have a bad day, so that is still going to happen. Always remember, guys, that life is a beautiful, tangled mess, and it is our job to make the most out of what we have been dealt with in life and make it the best time of our lives. You guys are awesome, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. Don't eat these. PSA, don't eat these. Don't be dumb. Don't eat these. Speaking of, I gotta wash my clothes now. Bye.